everyone, my name is Dizzy, and welcome back to some Hunter Call of the Wild. I am struggling to, to get streaming on, on the table in front of you, on all of your plates, as it were. Uh, and so this is probably going to be a, a little bit of a short stream. I don't know how long it's going to go for. Uh, it might be two hours, it might just be one hour, it really depends how I'm feeling uh, as we're going along. Uh, but thank you to everybody who is here and showing up. Thank you especially to Shaka in the chat already. It's lovely to see you, as always. I'm glad to hear that your morning thing went well. Uh, let me get some Hunter on your screen. Uh, and Kingle is here as well. Oh, you guys are sweet. Thank you so much. Yeah, I don't I don't know what's exactly up with, with the old brain case today. Uh... And yesterday, I guess, because uh, I, I had to finish early yesterday as well. Um, my little PND tuber. Okay, luckily you can't see it, but my little PND tuber has, has some letters uh, on her window that say, No DC. And I don't know why she has those little letters. You can't see them, they're in the bit of the, the window that is not actually captured. But uh, that's a little odd. I'm sure that's fine. <laughs> Let's not think about that too hard. Um, but yes, the hunter. Are we are we seeing hunter? We are seeing hunter. <laughs> no difficulty check. Apparently, she gets the District of Columbia. Uh, well, the, the District of Columbia they don't get to vote, right? I seem to remember that being a thing. Like Washington D.C., they don't vote or something. Which I, I mean, I'm against that. I think that's not right. Uh, let's hop on it to. Uh... Oh, Hershey Felden. I have no idea where we are, but we're in a lovely forest. Uh, uh, b -b 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 we probably have some like missions and stuff as well. <laughs> what am I doing? Missions, boars. Oh yes, boars, of course. Uh, yeah, last time, or maybe the time before that, we splattered some boars and they didn't count against our goal, which was... I wasn't I wasn't tremendously pleased, I'll be honest. Ah, <laughs> uh, Kingo says there's some really funky brackets derogatory stuff going on with DC democracy. Oh dear. Uh well, we seem to be right close to this. So let's plop a waypoint on that. Let's uh check what ammo we need topping up on. Uh we need a lot more 2-2H polytips. We need some more uh, 7.62 weird ones, and we need some more Tickle Commas arrows. 2-2-H body tips by, by, 7.62 weird things. There we go. By, and then arrows. Tickle Commas arrows. Bye. Fantastic. All right. Let's get a move on. Hop off into the forest. Yeah, I'm not going to go straight back to the boars. Uh, what time is that, actually? I'm not going to go straight back to the boars. I'm going to see if I, I can do some hunting around elsewhere and maybe relieve the pressure on that area a little bit. Would be ideal. Uh, it's a beautiful day in sunny Germany. You have the crack the on, which is always good. And yeah, we're just gonna sort of chillax. A little bit. And apparently we are not gonna go up this hill, is, is another thing we're going to do. There we go. Oh, it's it's a pretty nice day outside IRL. I've forgotten to close my window, so if at any point there is noise from outside, then I have to take a break to get up and do that. Uh, but it's been nice. It's looking... The weather forecast sort of says rain is on its way at any time in the next week or so. Um, Mother's been saying, like, oh, well, is this going to be it, all we get for summer? I'm like... Mother, last summer nearly killed every plant in our garden with how hot it was. Do you really want that again? 
Attack says if you've not closed your window, the outside will come inside. That's fine, because I've taken my hay fever tablets today. I remembered. I did remember. In fact, I've been told that hay fever tablets make you drowsy. Like antihistamines make you drowsy. So maybe that is why it is, it is a struggle at the moment for me to, to be doing the things. <laughs> Aww, thank you for taking care of me, though. Yeah, I was going to be running a D&D later today. A one-shot. But people can't make it. And honestly, that's kind of a good thing, given that I'm struggling to focus. Yeah, so some of this means there are also non-drowsy ones. Loratidine and Satyrazine are apparently non-drowsy ones. Well, they're the ones that, that never work for me. Um, the ones I take um, are... Oh god, what are they called? I know the brand names. It's Pyroton and Olivia. Um, Pyroton is Chloramphenazole, I think, or something? And... Olivia is... No, I can't remember what it is. It's something. It's. I think it's relatively new to the market, Olivia. Because I, I never used to... Oh, not that one. I never used to see it around. <coughs> Plot for naming, there we go. <laughs> Wonderful. Uh, you think it's that's a Fenadin? Yes, that that rings a bell. There we go. Oh, of course, King God knows everything about this because you're a you're a you're a not a pharmacist. <laughs> Chloramphenicol is an antibiotic. There we go. Oh, okay. No, I remember. I remember Chloramphenicol because um, I used to use it in the lab. There we go. That's why. That's why that's a word that's in my head. Do do. I did a test to see if chloramphenicol would remove contaminating bacteria from my archaea cultures. And the answer was it mostly removed the archaea from my archaea cultures. <laughs> Unfortunately. Um, well, we've got a nice lovely open space here. But uh, there's no one in it. And we've discovered that thing on our map. What way is the wind blowing? The wind is currently blowing due south. So if I can, I want to find a place and then head north from it. Oh, that might be an excellent opportunity to actually tag some more of these ones down here. So let's go do that. Jack says, I have very random and varied drug knowledge due to vet nurse times. I'm assuming you didn't spend a lot of time doling out antihistamines as a vet nurse. But I don't know. That was lovely long view over there. You did a lot. Yes, lots of Pyroton. Fair enough. Shows me what I know about about veterinary veterinarianing. I was gonna say betting, but that's something else. Um, oh, that was a bit of a, a funky light thing. This is mostly for dogs with very minor allergies. You had to cut out hundreds for horses before. Wowzers! You, uh, we used to be able to get Pyroton or or off off label Pyroton possibly in. Big, 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 big pots of like a hundred or five hundred or something, and you can't get that anymore, or at least we can't get that where I am anymore. Um, and it's gutting because <laughs> I, I have allergies. Youngest brother has allergies. Father has real bad allergies. Um, and we did sort of used to we did used to need <laughs> the pot of of a hundred or something. 
When we're all back for summer, it's the height of Haiti this season. There's three massively allergic people in the house. Jesus. Do I have a goose gun? Uh... I have the wasp on five. That's my goose gun. It says you could probably find it online, but be careful they don't think you're dealing. <laughs> What would even be the point in dealing in Piraton? Ah. Jack says, I learned that random side effects is an antidepressant. Mirtazapine is a good appetite stimulant. It's the only reason it's used in cats. Ah. That's neat. I remember when I was on uh, antidepressants, I, I I didn't ever feel like anything ever. But it they took it. What it did do is it made someone who was already always hungry all of the time me, and made me even more constantly wanting to put food in my face, which did not do me a lot of good. I think. Noise. Trying to track that fox, what we heard. I don't exactly know where the fox was, but he was over there somewhere. Got a bit of a VR onto that field. But if Foxy was over there, he'll be able to the corner. Jack says, GP suggested me has been to my ex once. As soon as I heard the name, I was like, he won't want that due to its biggest side effect. Ah. Into super quiet modes. God damn it! Wily foxes. Much too cunning for dizzies. Much, much too cunning for dizzies. Question: If I if I were to only stream for an hour and we didn't see any animals at all. <laughs> Apart from geese flying overhead. Oh, hello. Ah, fox, there you are. Yeah, look out. Bust out. Uh, I would really like you to turn around. Oh, thanks. <laughs> Says, if that case, we still got to hang out with Diddy for an hour. Aww. Sweeties! It's a pheasant a very, very long way away over there. Which we're not gonna try for. Oh, I've not got a very good hit on this fox, apparently. Based on the fact that it isn't dead. Blood? Blood. Blood trail. There we go, blood trail. No organs hit. And it hasn't gone down. Hmm. That's distressing. I wonder what I did hit. There's oh hello. There's not a lot of places you can shoot a fox from the front and not kill it. Oh, hang on, there's a few of you actually, aren't there? Alright, what are you? You're a. uh, 4 to 5, you're a 5 to 6. Oh, there's actually just two, okay. Well, we'll go for this one. Speaking 
pop a few bullets into them. Uh, oh, we have a Shesko in the chat! How's it going? Welcome! I hope you're having a lovely day. We have, in fact, successfully shot something, which is nice. I was worried we wouldn't. Number one. You are a silver. 5.96. Very lovely. Boost number two was over here a little bit more. Oh, the other fox. The fox has gone down. Uh, did we only get one hit on the goose? That's a bit of a disaster, if so. Um, I need to see some blood to know which way it went. You're feeling fuzzy today! Aww! Nope, I... I... Okay, the, uh, the waypoints are... Not my friend. There we go. Alright, we'll have that blood. There we go. So we can go back and find the fox. There's a pro deer off somewhere. I will have uh, splodged up more hunting pressure here than I was aiming for, which is a little unfortunate. Oh yeah, we're in the medium bleed brain. I find it very weird that nowadays class 1 is quite regularly can fly some considerable distance after you shoot them. It never used to be the case. They've obviously toughened them up quite a bit. Like this one's got a medium bleed rate and it's gone pretty far. That's crazy. The mist is coming in. A little bit of morning fog. But like then this goose is going to go this far. <laughs> I would have done things different. Was a ruby in this dark. Give him a little squeak. Just on the off chance. How is this goose still alive? They did the thing where the track, the last track, leads off in the wrong direction. I wish they didn't do that. I don't know why it does that. I wonder if it's that, that like, it's sort of an overflow error type thing where the last track just points towards the first track that that animal has ever made. Solved by just making a dead animal track that you can't see or interact with underneath where the animal's body is. Uh, uh, we're gonna run back because I've already splatted more animals here than I was hoping for. So it won't be too much of a problem if I scare any more off. Nom. There's some pieces over in the next field, but it's fine. Do, 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 do. We're keeping our binoculars very steady as we jog. It's kind of 
kind of impressive. Oh, must get. I have to think what they came for. That's right up close. That's right close. Where are you? Where are you? I can't see you properly. Go in circles. I'm zeroed wrong, that's what the problem is. Hang on, hang on, I'll get you. I won't get you at all. Where did you go? You're over there somewhere. Is that you? That is you. He's not coming out to land. Oh well. We tried. We 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 emptied our gun. And am I offline? No. Hmm. My little Twitch monitoring app is uh saying that Twitch is not responding. Do -do -do. Let me see if I can get chat back. Chat, are you there? Are you are you receiving me? Oh, okay, yeah, no, you are here. Weird. Alright. Oh, How odd. Uh, I will double check that we didn't get any hits. How do I... How do I activate this, this info point? Uh... Hello? Oh, wait, wait, I had it! Where was it? Okay, there was a... An interactable point here somewhere. Right. Hello? There. Amazing. Hunting tip. The field ridge next to this can gives you great line of sight in all directions. Thanks. Alright, anyway. Gotta go track down this fox. What we shot ages ago and it took about an, a real world hour, no, an in-game hour to die. Which, uh, is a little bit of a blemish on our record, it must be said. Can you go in this direction? Yes, okay. Have to scare animals for a bit. I will need to settle down. Finish. This is going to be a very long track. Gooses, over that way. So we're a little ways off the path to the left. Probably in this field. Action again. Need to see anyone. So as to not spook them. Down below, three quarters. But like I said, this is going to be a long chase. Ah, but joining us on this long chase, we have a salty. Hi there, how's it going? I hope you're having a wonderful day today. This is probably not going to be a tremendously long stream because uh, our brain is being is being uncooperative. 
but we are here and hunting for however long we, we hunt here for. I've, I've, I've gathered a chat full of individuals who are all too nice, obviously. Uh, I this just on the off chance that it's something new, but I'm not expecting it to be. Oh, it is! Never mind. <laughs> Uh, do you promise, Salty? No, I'm kidding. Uh, Thacker is, is, is correct. We've already gone quite some distance. Okay, we've just passed the halfway point. So, if we take that distance and double it, we'll possibly sort of end up there-ish, depending on exactly which way the fox turns. rate is very low because we shot it with quite a small bullet and we shot it quite badly with that small bullet. I think I might have put him in his shoulder possibly rather than the chest that I was aiming for. That is my suspicion. Ah, and we have a boom boom in chat as well. How's it going? I hope you're having a wonderful day. We are on the trail of a fox. A very, very long trail of a fox, but that's my fault. Much tidying, very certainly. Oh dear. Oh, it's such a mood though. I, I hate how, how sort of hot and bothered and sweaty, but just not objectively moving very far. But, but going back and forth and, and carrying things, bending down, healing stuff, etc. It all sort of adds up too. Blood, more blood. <laughs> By asking you to tidy their place, Salty? Question mark? It says it's the coldest day in like a week. Also, the only day I've opened the window, you're still horrendously down. Ah, yeah. Yeah. Having said that it was it was quite nice outside, it has since sort of cast over and become a little grey. So maybe the sweet relief of rain will come at least where I am. <laughs> oh salty. <laughs> oh, going around in a little circle. And the wind has changed, it's now blowing exactly the way we're going, because that is how the wind in this game looks. It might have turned again, possibly. Yeah, okay, it's going that way. I'm gonna quickly go off track, just to grab this feeding zone here. Let's see... No body around. Oh, hello. Maybe not. 
Oh, there. <laughs> where's, that, where's that road here? Well, I guess we know his uh, his feelings and it was. I completely did not see you at all. Don't know if anyone else did. You you could see the same thing as me. Any of you see the road here? <laughs> Zone. Oh, it's not even your zone. It's the pig zone. <laughs> oh, boom, boom. Oh, I mean, I think that sort of counts. Bum, bum. Okay, we're under a quarter. That's excellent. We're gonna spend like half the stream just on this one fox. <laughs> um. Excuse me. Oh, and the sleepiness is setting in. It's hidden itself away in the rocks. As we know, rocks are my nemesis. Really, it's off the way in the rocks. Going up. Up the hill, hills are my other nemesis. different types of nemesis. Hills are like an enemy that you you have to sort of fight every episode. Every episode you have to deal with a horrible hill. But rocks, you don't always have to, to deal with them. They're not always causing problems. So when they cause you problems, they're often causing much bigger problems than the hill. Which of those two villain archetypes? Like the rocks come out for like the season finale. Give me brief. The hills are a filler villain that you get sort of a, two or three times a series, at least. Which of those is my nemesis? Uh, hello? Sure, I'm, I'm caught. A filler villain or a hiller villain? Oh dear. Oh dear, oh dear. Looks like we're going off this way. You think that would make the boss my nemesis? In fact, in fact, to put it into terms that I can comprehend more easily, the the hills are the Daleks and the rocks are the master. Or maybe Rassilon, but probably the master. Oh, is that a body? That is a body! That is somebody having a munch. Which is unfortunate because uh it's going to be tremendously difficult to get to them. Oops, I fell down the hill so much I put my bath in this way. Good 
here. You can you can move slowly and quietly, or you can go up slight inclines. You can't do both. Here we have a a perfect storm of a big rock causing you problems and a hill. Where is the monkey coming? From? On! Ah, oh, this is nightmarish. Might have to. Oh, can't I get up the hill by jumping? Disaster! I'm gonna spook whoever's here if I keep doing this. There's no other way up the hill. Oh great. We got we got two feet further. On Given that it didn't obviously respond to my fellow. And also, just given the map we're on, in general, it's almost certainly a road deer, I would imagine. No, don't fall off the rock! Loud. Why did you have to be at the top of this hill? Really? There's no way to get up the hill quietly. Really close now. Please let me up. Okay. We must be so close. We must be so close. Final hurdle. Oh, please. Let me over this tiny incline. French. Oh. On! This is so maddening. If that creature is still there, then I'll be astonished. Oh my god, are you kidding me? Are you kidding me? There, okay, I can see you. Right. What the big thing teleported? Right when I was about to shoot it. Climb. Well, that was a lot more hassle than it needed to be. But we did get it. Oh, it's raining. That would probably have been helpful, actually, because I'm quieter in the rain. Let's see. 
Where's the next town I'm going to? It could have been a better shot, but it was a sufficient good shot. Which is all that really matters. There, there's the one. Okay. And from there, wind is blowing south again, so I guess we'll head up that, that way. Oh, I didn't even get him in the shoulder. I got him in the leg. Ugh. Terrible shooting. Atrocious shooting going on. Big yumps. Big yumps to get up the hill. Started to go away, but only started. Oh, hello. Oh. A nice herd of hello deer. I think all females. See about sneaking out using this bush as cover. And then hopefully we'll be able to get some bow shots off. Some nice clean quiet kills. Hello. A male. One mixed the horns. That's German, because we're we're in Germany. Okay, 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 okay. Incredible. Whoa boy. I took the shot. It was very greedy to take the shot, but I took the shot. 
we did not hit. Oh my god, there's quite a lot of you. Going really every which way. Oh my gosh! Wow. That was a surprise. <laughs> oh, oh, hello. Oh my god, there's a bigger one. Hi! Well, we got three, which is one more than I was expecting. Little bronze male. Female number one. Oh, that was a heart shot. I noticed it dropped like almost instantly, which I'm pretty pleased about. This one also dropped pretty instantaneously. Where did we hit you? Double along that one, but still, very, very proud of that shot. Uh, all right, onwards and northwards, because I think that that other one with the antlers will have uh, been long gone by now. Okay, I think that's just trees. I think that's just tree ambience that I can hear. Whatever this next thing is, it's right on the path. Given that the path goes next to some fields, I think I'm going to take the road. Well, road path, same thing. Nope, 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 this one. Oh, hello. Hello. He's back again. Deer was off in this direction. Red deer, sorry, was off in this direction. There's a big open field there. I think it's a hundred ninety-ish meters away. I seem to recall. So there. Oh, a big one as well. Hang on, wait, what was the range? Uh, okay, it's coming this way. Two hits. They'll hope they were good ones. Oh, this is a lovely, lush looking field. I love the colour of it. Dang. Hasn't gone down yet. So our shots can't have been that good. Hmm. I've had two rounds in that thing. Was I off zero? No, oh, I was at the right zero. Blood? Oh, that's dropping. Around somewhere, hopefully. Okay, that's blood. That is a radio. Road deer has run off. I'll come back to that. Lead rate very low. No organs hit! I, I was sure I was well, well on target for both of those shots. I guess that's why it's not died. Okay. 
Well, I've seen that that one's probably not going to die. And instead we'll go after this road here, which apparently I also got a really knack shot on. Oh. I'm very surprised. Very, very surprised about that. they're going in the same direction. There's no reason not to keep the marks. Keep over this hill. There you are. Okay, third time's the charm. Unfortunately that means we won't get the harvest check. But we have at least taken it out. It's always good to clean up after your mistakes and not leave animals just wandering around half dead. Not, not, not for game reasons. For game reasons, it's actually way better to leave it alive. Because um, if you leave it alive when you leave the game and come back, then it'll be alive at full health. But just leaving, yeah, as, as Jack says, it's good hunting etiquette. Just leaving a bunch of uh, deer wandering around with bullets in them is not, not very, not very humane. The bow shot was a little off, but it was at a reasonable range, well, that's to be expected. And then you're over here somewhere. I did have a frag. Friend does not seem to be made to hear though. Southwest. Uh, I guess let's go to this. We'll, we'll change track. There's not a particular plan for today. Check the time. It's 10:45. When does the boar zone activate? 10 o'clock. I might grab this deer and call it there. We've been going for about an hour, which I know is a really, really short stream, but like I say, I'm not I'm not super feeling it. And then when we get back, we can, uh, whenever next time is, we can go straight up to the boar place and it'll be active. I think that sounds like a plan. Alright, what were you? You would have been a gold. But I didn't hit, any, in three shots, I didn't hit any vital organs. So the first one I caught your shoulder and I didn't manage to penetrate. The second one was... You can see why I thought this was an on-target shot. <laughs> it was a hair too low. And the third one that, that finished you off, it was you were on the move. I managed to catch the intestines because of uh, I didn't leave the shot enough. Gosh darn! <laughs> oh dear. Alright, well yeah, that's that's going to be it from us for today. Again, apologies for it being a really short stream. I'm, uh, I'm not, not feeling my streamy self today. Let's run up here, have a look out. There's the field, just a lovely field. And yeah, uh, that's what I'm going to call it. 
not going anywhere just yet, because I am going to send you out on a wee little raid. <laughs> oh, woof. How close are you? Close enough to do a warning call. Can I have my blockers back, please? Not close enough to be seen, though. Which I think is very rude. I'll do this. I'll do this, and then I'll go and look for a raid. And if you guys see a fox, you have to tell me, okay? You have to say that there's a fox if you see a fox, so I can go and shoot the fox. Oh god, why are you making noise at me? Twitch is making lots and lots of noise at me, which is very, very rude out of it. Ugh. Right, what was I doing? I was looking for raiders. Uh, there's a Visti live on on a Tuesday. Don't know what they're going to be streaming. Nomadi and Radders are playing Ravens Watch together, which I do not know what it is. Uh, well, we did a Nomadi raid yesterday, so let's go do a Radders raid today. How do I R A D D E R S S Radders? R A D D E R S S. Yes. Okay. Wonderful. Ah, um, yeah. Thanks, everyone, so much for for being here. Uh, I guess the fox didn't want to show up, which I mean, uh, m smart him, <laughs> really. Ah, uh, yes. I do hope you go. You enjoy uh, going to watch Radders. Uh, I'll be hopefully around tomorrow. It might be another short stream. I don't know what we'll be doing. Uh, things are up in the air right now, and. I'm not exactly sure why, like maybe it's just hay fever drowsy, but I also kind of woke up like this a little bit, so who knows really. Um, thank you so much to Shaka, to Boom Boom, to Sorty, to Shasko, to King Girl, all for being around in the chat. It was lovely seeing you today. It was lovely learning learning about the the medications as we were doing earlier, and also learning about Sorty's uh, upcoming new housekeeping service. <laughs> Um, if you miss me, you can find me on my various social media. Uh, Twitter and Mattern and Blue Sky should all be down below. Uh, I'll type exclamation mark Discord because I have a Discord server that you can join. That's the best place to get notifications from me because they happen automatically. Um, <laughs> salty. My name has been Dizzy. Thank you so much for being here. Whenever it is, I will see you next time. So everyone. Bye.